Hey guys, Basic Sorgonomics, Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter for your Friday edition Basic Sorgonomics podcast. <laughs> hey, time's been pretty crazy lately, a lot of stuff going on, and of course, you know, sometimes you can't do all the things, and I started thinking about, uh, you know, making a lot of decisions here about what we are are not doing, putting some barriers in place uh, to protect uh, to protect time. Um, actually, really, really thinking about that, it's been the subject of I think the last two episodes of uh, Back to Work with Merlin Mann over on the Five by Five Network, one that I avidly listen to and have for for a long, long time, and uh, and that's when that hits home. Um, it was, uh, and, and hopefully, I remember some of these phrases. You know, every minute weighs the same is one thing, and 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 talking about how. Uh, you manage your time and how important that is and how important are the things you're doing at the time you spend on them. Now, for me, of course, a uh, main, main focus, I'm putting pouring so much into the business and the work and building things. And, and I feel like we're we're kind of on the cusp of something really cool, although I feel like I've been saying that for about a year now. Um, but uh, even more so, a lot of opportunities are popping up. Uh, in the in the last few weeks, in these first few in this first month of the new year, geez, this is the last episode of January already. It'll be Christmas again before you know it. Maybe I'll put the tree up this time. But uh, you know, but over the years, I mean, this is something that uh, you know, I started thinking to some of the transitions I've had about letting certain things go uh, that have led to building blocks and building blocks to where we're at now. And again, going through a phase where I'm letting th- certain things go, certain projects. Uh, certain 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 things on the side uh, are kind of shedding away to make room for some hopefully bigger and greater things, and that's something that we've done for a long time. Uh, you know, the earliest example I can think of uh, right now is you know Western PA Juggalos was it was a was a site that I did for nine and a half years, which turned into a lot of great opportunities and a lot of ideas and a lot of uh, uh, early creative uh, endeavors. That, that really cut my teeth on a lot of, uh, you know, concepts that would become what we're doing today. And, you know, streaming, first bad at streaming radio, first bad at community. And in deciding to let that go was, you know, you know, knowing that I've accomplished all I have in that space uh, and, and, and hoping to build something bigger out of the ashes of that. And that begot Wrestling Mayhem Show as I stare across the studio at the big banner uh, behind the guest couch and thinking about all the things that we've done and all the p- possibilities and the interesting opportunities that are available and, and upcoming and the discussions we're having of some things that could be even cooler in the coming months. And, and all because we, we started with, a, you know, I, I always say, you know, all this because I started a wrestling podcast 10 years ago. But all of that is because I started a, an ICP fan site uh, uh, 15 years ago. And that's how long we've been doing this. And, 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 you know, looking at, okay, we decided to shed away that, uh, even though it still kind of lives on in a Facebook group, you know, without a lot of my touching, um, no touching, but, uh, or, or where you did the rap group and deciding, okay, this is a thing that we can't do anymore because of, you know, uh, personal reasons and, and, you know, let's move on to something else and whatever that might be. And those are all things at the times were just kind of creative supplements to whatever my day job was. And now that that has come around to, okay, uh, we're trying to make this bigger. You know, what, what are we working on? What are we trying to accomplish that's holding us back from stuff? And the question comes up. There's certain things that I've been doing for several years that we've been looking at. And, and the question keeps getting asked, especially if it's a project. And there are several projects uh, I look at all the time between the pro wrestling I've done in some capacity um, filming or, or whatever since about 2007. So, geez, we're, we're coming up on 10 years here. Uh, I guess we're about nine years in or whatever the case may be and figuring out is, is does that still have a place in the, in the scope of things uh, right now? It's not on the chopping block, but, uh, but, but, but it's something that's constantly analyzed and seeing where we can go with that uh, to, to projects that aren't client projects. They're kind of the fun projects, you know, that, but you know, they have their place um, or certain projects that are like, okay, we've done, we've, 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 done the course on on something and we need to uh let that go and 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 find something else to fill that void you know whether it be mostly time and and that is that's the biggest thing that i've i've laid down to is i can't do all the things um i'm lining up a lot of projects but you know not that's not to say no to any of them but knowing i can't promise them all 
uh, it, it's an exciting spot to be in where I don't have to, I, I, I have to decide, yeah, we can do that thing. I'll get to you in two weeks because I have a couple others in the queue. I have a queue now. That's amazing. Or having to decide, okay, I can't help you with your weekly show because I have five other ones that I'm doing. You know, where do we go from there? And at what point? Well, maybe I need help. You know, maybe I need something more than me to to uh, to to help grow this. Um, but again, also something we've been working on for a while. But for now, it's uh, what do we shed? What do we do? What do we not take on? Um, there's plenty of things I've been offered that I can't take on anymore, or I'm passing them to other people and giving them opportunities to work with these groups. Uh, you know, as they build up their their own clientele in a certain uh, aspect. You know, and it's a, it's a really cool. And, and again, kind of finding uh, that opportunity. Um, there's a, I forget which which site, which, who it was that I was listening to. They say, I'm, I, I think I think it's one of the podcast networks, you know, it says, you know, I'm really excited when I'm able to write checks to the people that work with me, you know, and I am too. I, to, you know, I, I, that feels good that I'm signing checks now and paying people and actually paying some of them like, a pretty good rate based on what we're doing and that's and we're we're able to build with that and build the certain people into these spots and 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 you know being able to do that but we can't fit we're not a fit for everybody for for how sidekick media services for how sorgatron media is for for the wrestling side of things you know we we can't go work for everybody uh but uh it's a it's 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 a uh, kind of a, a struggle to do that um and when you're moving on with your 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 projects your clients when you're moving on you built that thing on the side and you kind of have to drop the anchor of you know maybe it maybe maybe the thing on the side has built up big enough that you're it's eclipsing your day job which is a great place to be or maybe not even anything on that size. Maybe it is uh, something where you're working with multiple clients in some aspect, and you go and 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 you know decide. All right, we got to shed this away because it's really more than just you know financially. It's just eating time away from other things we could be doing to move forward. You know, uh, and it's a you know it's it's it's, it's a hard decision to make. And, but sometimes when you've uh, when you're starting to think in that way, you can't think of anything else. It's like time to move on, time to move on. Um, some of the stuff in my head this week, as far as things go, uh, it's been a really interesting ride here uh, in 2016 already. Uh, so uh, I don't know. I, I think my question for the week is, um, uh, what is uh, what, what's something you had to shed to get it get that that to to make room for something did you start a podcast so you killed off another project did you have to kill your podcast so you could do another do another even more important project and did that turn into something uh, that was the right move something bigger you know or was it something you uh, attempted or glad you did and kind of sorry that you did uh whatever the case may be let me know that's your question of the day uh, uh, you know, what, what is something that you, you, you had to, you had to let go of just to, just to move on a little bit. Let me know at Sorgatron on the Twitters. Hope you guys have a great weekend. Please check out everything at sidekickmediaservices.com. All the shows over at sorgatronmedia.com. Yes, I know it needs a redesign. Now, now that's in my head and I'm always going to be thinking about that, but, uh, and check out some other great stuff. Um, our interview with Max Holt of livestream.com over at awesomecast.net. Because uh, we're talking about the Movi camera, it's coming out here in April. That we we're talking about a couple of weeks ago on the on the Awesome Cast itself. Uh, so that was a pretty cool connection that we got come around. Uh, so uh, and check out all the other uh, fun and interviews we have going on, and so much more. Uh, Sogertron.com for the blog and the videos. We'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.